Hassani is probably unhappy about the attention Rema is getting. He said, and I quote, you know, you know, I'm looking at Rema's show in America, in New York, etc. Um, my shows actually had way more people, at least by four times, but not many people talked about it as much as they, they're talking about his. I think our genre has more work to do to really get the kind of attention and regard, end of quotes. <coughs> Benny. That's it, but Hassani gave, he gave himself a solution right there. Mm. All right, you, you're doing, your, your genre of music is quite uncommon. Mm -hmm. In this climate, trust me, someone like Rikasani will go to some other countries, some other Asian countries, and his music will be well appreciated and accepted with fans, a lot of fans, you know. But his kind of music is still so much, um, it's not caught up with, with the populace as yet. And so the comparison between him and Rema doesn't even come to play, mm -hmm. you know. Um, Rema's kind of music is what is what is what is um, what is commonplace right now, mm -hmm. you know, with his own style. And he rightly said it, that there's more popularization that should be done for that kind of general music. Alternate sound is just now beginning to appreciate alternate sound. Mm -hmm. I mean, before now, you're on your own. You know, so I don't want to sit by way of comparison because Rick Asani is too mature, he's too big for that. That's why he's an agbaya for you the know, streets. So I mean, like he's, I've been uh, waiting to say it, I'm waiting for you to get to your point where I'm coming. He's yeah, a big yeah. agbaya you know, I'm for sorry because this is, this, is, this is Rick Asani, this is Rema. Sorry? Yes. You know, mm -hmm. It, it, um, no, because no, no, even if, if, well, if you're you saying know. that, I agree with you. Because if you're saying that you have four, um, um, like times four of the people he had at his own show, then I mean, you have your money, so enjoy and keep this tweet to yourself. Mm. So if I you think you want people to talk about you, <laughs> pay people to do your promotion. It's that simple. So Rick Asani should understand that Remus can style of music, your music will appeal to the masses greatly than his kind of music. So there is no, there's no ground for comparison between Rema and Rikasani. So that is definitely what I mean. Rikasani is, is, is a great singer, mm. um, great songs, you know, but not just the kind of tunes we appreciate around here that much. I so mean, Rema came on the scene, boom, it was instant, it was instant for him. The spotlight was on him, he was straight into the limelight. Well, let's not um, forget the man behind him also. I was and his years of experience. Yeah. Yeah. You know? him, so I, you I, cannot take the him. work Don Jazzy is doing I mean, away. The if the you're not doing him. that kind of work for your brand, it doesn't happen. There. The, it's man, not the man behind him is actually the, the prince. Rema is the prince's um, artist. Well, you know, yeah, on the, on right, the but then... Now again, publicity needs to be done. Um, that's why I said Rick Asani, he, he brought about the problem and he also provided the solution. So mm. you should go ahead and do what he needs to do. And then again, your publicity team, they need to do more work than they're doing right now for you. That's where we should start from. There's no yeah. point I mean, in But if you need a solution, he didn't need to come and start talking about it. Pay people to talk about it and it will trend. The thing is, there's so many things going on in the media space that some are oblivious to. Now, they feel it happens just like, like that. Well, that's how we want it to feel like it happens. But there's so much going behind mm. the scenes. So, Rama is in New York or whatever, having a big show. Everybody and someone is. in Nigeria is telling you, is probably tweeting the video and saying, oh, this is happening, this is awesome. No, it, it did not just happen. There is a chain of communication. Mm. Someone was there. It's a concerted effort. Yeah, someone was going there on. having fun, sharing the video with them, making them feel, oh, this is awesome. Someone is also here to make sure people at home are understanding what is going on. When you tell these people to have proper PR, they feel like you just want to collect their money or no, we are, we are not all about the social media life. But when they are making the money they want to make, which it is the aim, right? I'm happy for you. You are making your money. You had four times people in your show. And then you see someone is not talking about you. You are still very worried about people not talking about you. But you said your aim is to make money and not be talked about. So you need to balance what you want and get it both ways. It's not like you cannot afford it. You can. So even if you have to book a session with Don Jazzy and say, I need to see you, but what can I do? This is what I was talking about when we were talking about diet. It's not just about coming out to say they don't appreciate me. Sometimes you sit down with these people and ask them, what can I do to be better? But yeah. if you're about the money, like you said, enjoy your money. No, no man is an island on, on its own. And, so, um, and you're, you're in an industry that's very competitive. There's nothing wrong with seeking advice. And I, again, I'm going to say this, credit to Rick Asani. He does great music, but not just the kind of popularized music around this area. So he if does needs, good music. Yeah, does I appreciate his music. music. And I think yeah, people, people appreciate Rikasani. But for Rikasani yeah. to be picking on Rema, that is what they call typical Agbaya. 
like even age wise let's forget about business wise like yeah. this is a young boy coming into the industry embrace him and let him feel comfortable you're not like the one who should be treating this like, it's not Can't i'm not remember. comfortable no, no, I'm not no. No. i mean and rikazani's song you can't play it at a club you can't play it i mean it's songs that are made for some a few specific moments mm -hmm. it's not something you can play everywhere so you, like you said there is no yeah. ground for comparison you really cannot compare rema and they're just two different people. Anyway, we love them both at least, mm. but um, let's behave ourselves.